That's pretty nice. Did she? Big patch of tube worms here. The uh, tube worms here, they are rooted down into the sediment, as I understand. Is that yep. right, true, Sarah? Yep, that is true. So they have a large sort of root system. Massive patches of tube worms. Sarah, are we yeah. seeing critters in between the tube worms? Or is it pretty uh, much just tube worms there? Well, there's crabs and clams. The little circle things are the tube worms. Oh, OK. Th there, there are some other possibly like anemone-like looking things. It's hard to tell. The orange? E well, that, oh. yeah. And then um, you can't see it right now. Oh, crabs. Hey, there's hey, definitely some dudes. other critters here. Yeah. Just hanging out. Do we want to sample anything here, or do we just want to stop and look? So, Bob and Gabby, we, we were going to want to sample some of these eventually. Um, but I suspect they'll be very long because most of them is going to be within the sediment. So how do you think would be best to sample them and, and to get them back up to the surface? Well, we're going to have to put them in the, in the uh, starboard box over there. Okay. The problem with that is is that the thrusters tend to wash things out of the box. Yeah. So you gotta you got to get them over there and then turn the thrusters off and stuff them in the box and get it closed kind of quick because we'll be okay. floating up. Uh -huh. What are a couple of ways we're going to sample tonight? So tonight we are going to be sampling some of the tube worms that we can see on the screen right now. And with that, we are going to be slurping the assemblage itself to try and get epifauna that are living on the tube worms. And then we're going to use the manipulator to uh, take some samples of the tube worms themselves and put them in the bio box. And then we are going to take core samples of a bacterial mat and, and those clam there. beds. Mm -hmm. And then we're also going to take some slurps in those areas. Um, so a lot of different types of sampling. All right, so why don't we try our first slurp sample on on this one? We'll probably do a few slurp samples of the Full tube lighting. worms. Um, use anything but two and three. Two and three have the fine mesh, and I want to save those. Oh, the do fish we want to slurp come sample along. a grenadier? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> should fit, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is to try and get some of the animals that are living in these aggregations. Um, that might not make it once we start pulling off the tube worms and putting them in the bio box. Got it. Are you seeing things going in the bucket? I'm not seeing things, but I'm seeing water flow. I can, I'll, the I'll increase the section. Maybe we'll get some things. Yeah. So again, we're doing a little vacuuming here of these tube worms. I'm not seeing many things go in. What about that thing? Uh, that thing? Yeah, I've seen a couple things. <laughs> <laughs> One or two. Um, yeah. But, oh, there we go. Lots of things. Some things. <laughs> Mostly <laughs> dust. <laughs> oh, I saw a thing. Yeah. That that was a def a definite thing. Definite thing. <laughs> Some of those little uh, things. Spotted anemone looking things. You must be great at vacuuming at Thank home, Bob. <laughs> <laughs> you got a job at the Holiday Inn. Yes, there you go. <laughs> What's that white? Is that sponge? Or <laughs> 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 All right. Will the fly trap thing fit, or is it too big? It, it's pan. If you pan up a little, should be able to see it. Yeah, yeah that orange. Orange. get that thing. Yeah, Can you get that thing? It's probably hanging on pretty good, though. Oh, yeah. maybe we'll just try and pluck them off with it. If it doesn't work, we can pluck them off with it. Slurp them. Oh, yeah, he oh, just, like, closed, closed up. Yeah. I oh. mean, can you really blame him? <laughs> he's <laughs> kind of angry. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It came out of the he's sky. It had lights, and it was whirring, and it came out with this little suction thing. And <laughs> Oh, yeah, and I bet his buddies would never believe him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Those things don't exist. Look at all those bubbles up in there. Oh, wow. Wow, well, wow, well, wow. Well. Are hydrate? they hydrates? <laughs> Oik. Uh, Sarah, we found some hydrates. I can't look oh, up in there. Oh, yeah, it's on the Why outside. Not? That's what's oh, going on. Oh, look at all those hydrates. <laughs> oh, my goodness. There's our bubbles. How's your buoyancy now? Got some stuff. There are definitely some things in there. Yeah. <laughs> Well, why don't it's just all brown. do you think maybe we could um, 
uh, sample the tube worms and then if, and, and then if that frees up some stuff, slurp again into seven and then. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Well, I don't know how many heads we. You want to just grab a clump? Yeah. Because it's going to be hard to. Yeah, a clump pick sounds good. Onesie twosies. That might um, bring along some some travelers too. Well, these guys don't want to stick their heads back in. So we're trying to sample some of these tube worms that are very specialized for living in this environment. Oh, they're roots. These methane. Uh, these are these are also sort of mini ecosystems. How many of these are you trying to get? There's lots of other smaller animals. A good amount. <laughs> and are they going in starboard bio? Yes. Yes. Okay. How many is it? I mean, uh, is this like we gonna have to do eighty of these grabs or? No, just a few. Just a few more of those grabs. Okay. I, I think will be good. Okay. So are you just after genetic stuff, or are you trying to get the whole worm intact? Ideally, the worm intact. Wow. That's a nice grab. They didn't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Could wow. you try and get that anemone yeah. in this one? Cool. Is that the same kind, just closed up? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh you got one, though. Yeah. yeah. Yep. You got a couple yeah. things. You got a couple, cool. Got a couple critters in there. Awesome. We're going to have fun tomorrow. Mm. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> 9 a.m., right? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Should probably go to sleep soon. <laughs> oh, yeah. How many are we taking? This will be the last one. All That's right. perfect. Thanks for getting that anemone. Well, we're sitting at this beautiful methane seep site off the Oregon coast, about 1,230 meters. Until this morning, we didn't know it existed. So we're a place on the earth, very beautiful, that we had no idea was here before early today. It's quite exciting. Yep. Any more arm work here? Nothing here. Now we are going to be looking for a bacterial mat to core and a clam bed to core. We will slurp at those sites too, and um, we're probably gonna collect from one more tube worm bed assemblage.